Hello friends, I'm so glad to be here with another video. How are you all doing? Thank you so much for always coming by to watch my video. I sincerely appreciate it. In this video, friends, I'm talking about the Super Eagles of Nigeria. Uh, the Super Eagles of Nigeria will be camping in Abidjan, Côte d'Ivoire, ahead of final Africa Cup of Nations qualifiers. But before I delve into it fully, I like to say thank you so much for the love and support you give all the time. If you are new, please subscribe to the channel, press the notification bell so that you don't miss out in my subsequent videos, and also help to share the video if it is possible for you to do. I will appreciate it greatly. Okay? Thank you so much, all my friends out there. Watch the video to the end. Yes, the Super Eagles to camp in Abidjan ahead of final AFCON qualifiers. The Nigerian Super Eagles will open their training camp on Sunday, the 10th of November, in Abidjan, Côte d'Ivoire, ahead of their crucial 2025 African Cup of Nations qualifying match against the Benin Republic. According to the reports, Super Eagles players will fly directly to Abidjan from their respective bases for the encounter scheduled for Thursday, the November 14th at the Uvet Boudin Stadium in Abidjan. The stadium has been home to Benin's uh, Chetas during their AFCON and World, qualifi World Cup qualifiers. Nigerian Super Eagles currently lead Group D with 10 points from 4 games. The three-time African champions are in a strong position, needing only a draw against Benin to secure their place at Af AFCON 2025, hosted, to be hosted by Morocco. Benin sits second in the group with six points, followed by Rwanda with five points, and Libya with a single point. After the game against Benin in Abidjan, coach Austin Iguavon will lead the Nigerian contingent back to the country where they will tackle Rwanda in the final AFCON qualifiers on 18th of November. Nigeria defeated Benin 3-0 in the first leg, meeting Uyo and drew goalless with Rwanda in Kigali. Meanwhile, Semi Jai is said to miss the two games as he has been ruled out due to a long term injury. On a positive note, however, winger Moses Simon is available for selection following his timely recovery from a new injury. From a knee injury. Simon's return is a big boost to the Super Eagles offensive options, a key player for both Nigeria and his French club. Simon Miss Nantes' uh, recent 3-1 defeat to Strasbourg, but is expected to be freed for their League One clash against Mazer on Sunday. The 29-year-old has had an impressive league, uh, impressive season, registering two goals and three assists so far. So Nigeria is aiming to overrun Benin Republic again as they meet in the qualifiers, African Cup of Nations qualifiers in Abidjan, Côte d'Ivoire. As I said earlier on, uh, Côte d'Ivoire, Abidjan, Côte d'Ivoire has been the home of Benin Republic since this qualifier started. All right? I don't know what you have to say about the preparation of the Super Eagles for these two important matches. As I said to you earlier on, they only need a draw and they will be true for the 2025 African Cup of Nations. But I don't think they have to rest on their hours. There is no uh, small game, there is no cheap game again. Every team participating are fully equipped. 
to play and they are, they are aiming for the best just as Nigerian Super Eagles are also aiming for the best. Let's just hope that uh, it will be a good turnout for Nigeria as they play away in Nabijan against Beni and uh, the, back to Nigeria to face Rwanda. What do you think will be the outcome of the two matches? If you can predict what will be the outcome, the predict the result, I'll be glad. Please let me know what you think about these two matches. Do you think Nigeria winning the two matches and therefore qualified for 2025 African Cup of Nations? Or you are thinking otherwise? Let me know. Do you think there is any player that the the coach need to try or should be called to camp? Yes, Semi Ajayi has been ruled out due to injury, but there are other players that are capable. Okay? Let me know what you think. Thank you so much for always coming by to watch my video. I sincerely appreciate it. If you have not subscribed to the channel, please consider to subscribe to the channel now. I will be glad you do. Okay? That's all I have to share with you. But before I go, let me remind you that if you can dream it, you can achieve it. There is nothing on here that is not achievable. If your mind is set on it, it is doable, it is possible. Okay? Never, never allow anyone to talk you down or to move you back. Do not, do not doubt yourself. Believe in what you can do. Believe in your ability. You can make it. You can do it. Thank you so much, guys, for all your support and love. I will see you soon in my next video. Bye-bye.